Well, I almost went to jail today. Um, Ray's big white dog was out running loose, chasing me this morning. I was trying to cross the yard to get over to Barbara's house. Ray came out calling me a fucking bitch and telling me it was his fault his dog was out. Then in the meantime, the two little pugs got out, and they're the ones who scream and shriek. Well, I took Colt across the way over to uh, visit with Tiny. Tiny lives behind Barbara. Tiny is the landlord's dog. And I clipped him to Tiny's chain, and Weasel and I went in Barbara's house for coffee. And Tiny chewed through the loop on Colt's leash. I came out just in time to see Colt running, still on his chain, but not attached to anything. And Ray went, come here. And Colt went to him, and his little pugs were running around. His pugs attacked Colt. So Colt defended himself. Ray picked Colt up off the ground by his choke chain. Well, he's a pretty weak little bastard, and I ran up behind him, and I grabbed the chain out from under his hands, and uh, couldn't move, because those dogs were whirling around, but I had the chain balled up, I mean, doubled up, in case I need to hit Ray, so he's right up my face. I never said a word. So, I took Colt and Weasel, and I locked him up in the cab of my truck. He went over to Barbara's house and started screaming at Barbara, you lied to me, you lied to me. You, you enable that bitch. You let that bitch. We were just having a cup of coffee. Well, it turns out Barbara's a two-faced liar and been telling me a bunch of stories and whatnot. One of the stories she heard was that I've been slowly sneaking my stuff out of here and moving it to Grant's. Grant's is on the way to Gallup. My ex lives in Gallup, so I think somebody's just getting, getting their gossip wrong. I haven't taken anything out. If I was going all the way to Grant's, I'd be taking my utility trailer, right? Save the gas. Well, I went over to Henrietta and I said, I'm moving out. And Joe said, good. And I said, I pointed to Joe's back and I told Henrietta, and that's why. Ray's sick and Ray's crazy. But Joe's the manager and the owner of the property. So I went back over to my house. I've been packing all day. Later this afternoon, I thought I'd better have two not too throwable metal leashes for both Weasel and Colt. Because I'm taking stuff down and they can both get out now. I was just fixing Colt's leash when he took off to go play with Tiny. I had his leash in my hand. And I walked over to go get him. Ray came out. Colt saw me with the leash, and he wanted to play with Tiny, so he just ran in circles and wouldn't come to me. He usually doesn't do that. He usually loves coming to the leash. But he just got out. He wanted to play with Tiny. Ray saw all this, and he came out. Come here. And I whirled around, tried to get to him in time, but Colt's faster than I am. Colt went right up to Ray, and Ray was choking him. And I pushed him. I pushed Ray. I actually put my hands on that pussy thing. Well, he hit me. Right in the chest. Right in the boobs. I had the chain. And I started whipping him with it. Henry came out. Hey, 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 hey. Like I'd done something wrong. Threatening to call the police on me. Well, I took my dog home. Wondered if I were ever going to take a bath my hair is wet. Bound it up, weasel. Got everybody on a chain. They're in here in the bed. Took my bath. Before I took my bath, I went over there and said, look, this is why I'm getting out of here. Joe's going to cover it for Ray. Everybody's going to lie about this. I'm leaving. Henrietta wants you to stay another month, but she's in trouble with the electric company. I'm like, why the hell do I owe you anything? I was sitting here freezing to death, no lights on. Nobody will help me with my water. Nobody will help me with the fence. So I'll bitch because my dogs get out. They won't help me with it. I'm afraid not to pay the rent. Because, you know, this is an RV park. If Joe wants to, he can give me 24 hours notice. So I don't know what the fuck I'm going to do. Today's the first. Tomorrow's the second. I'm going to finish back in the truck. I got about half packed. Um, I got a lot of stuff done, but boy, am I tired. In between having to deal with Ray. 
So tomorrow I'm going to try to make sure that the truck and the trailer are packed because that's the second. On the third, I'm going to meet with that guy about that place for rent. I dumped some trash today. And Ray was out there fucking around. He said, you wait till you get to Grant's. I'm going to kill you. So fine. Everybody thinks I'm moving to Grant's now. He's trying to kill me again. So I almost went to jail because even Henrietta was saying, I'm going to call the cops on both of you. And I, later I said, you know, Henrietta, that man has stolen coat and he has stolen weasel. The day he was dangling coat, coat or in a choke chain off the ground, I will defend my property. And if that man touches me, you're damn right I'm going to hit him. That's why you haven't seen me out here for months because I'm not dealing with this stuff. And Joe always taking his side. That man's dangerous. It's, I think it's a damn shame I have to walk around this park carrying a weapon. So I got everybody calmed down. But I'm still in serious. If he touches me with those filthy... He doesn't bathe. He hasn't had a bath in three years. One of his neighbors said he was bragging to her husband that the dogs clean him. He bragged to me he doesn't take a bath. He bragged to me he used to have chickens living in his house in Rio Rancho. That's why I got kicked out of there. He's been kicked out of five places before this one, you know. <sighs> Poor folks are like crabs in a bucket. When one of them starts to crawl out, the others pull on him and pull him back down in. That's exactly what's going on now. I got offered a job today. That I can do from home. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm moving to Grants. Tell everybody I'm moving to Grants. <laughs> the only reason I whipped him with that chain, and I was terrible, man. I didn't like put my full force of weight in, and I just put enough into it to make it sting. And I didn't go for his face. I went for his arm, and he was wearing a padded thingamajig. I didn't go for his face, I didn't go for his nuts. The only reason I hit him was when he takes lunch toward me. And he'd already hit me. That's the only reason. Well, I need some chocolate therapy. Probably about half a dozen cigarettes. <laughs> yeah. I didn't hurt him bad. It stung. I swear to God that thing's a rhinoceros. He doesn't have any sense of feeling at all. He can't feel anything but rage. All right, I've vented. Everybody say, oh, you poor thing, please. <laughs> I'm going to make it out of here, and I'm not going to go to jail. What he doesn't know is I'm a sneaky little bitch, and I know where he lives. But he thinks I'm going to be living in Grants. I am not going to kill him, okay? I'm not going to kill him. What I'm afraid of is that if I start hitting him, I won't be able to stop. I was this close to going to jail. I guess that's mostly what Ray and, uh, I mean, Joe and uh, Henrietta were doing over there was calming him down so he wouldn't file charges against me. I was just protecting my own. I made it clear to them he's not to touch my dogs, my property, or me because I will defend us. And Henry said, yeah, we know. Yeah, he's not allowed to go near you. In fact, when I went to take my trash out and had to go past him, he said, bitch, bitch, just wait to get your grants. I'm going to kill you. Henry had to came out of the house and stood there and said, Ray? She didn't hear him threaten me. They never hear him threaten me. They never see him vandalize my property. They never, when he steals my dogs, there's always some good reason why he's had my dog for 12 and a half hours without letting me know me here the whole time and him there the whole time. All right, I'll shut up now. YouTube. Muchísimas gracias. You make me feel a lot better because you just come in and you pat me on the head and you're my little cheerleaders. And You don't think I'm crazy. You've seen the news reports. Yeah, I'm moving to Grants, everybody. Spread the word. Ah! Oh, God, where's the button? How do you turn this?